adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. A reading from the Gospel according to Mark. And they clothed him in a purple cloak, and after twisting some thorns into a crown, they put it on him. And they began saluting him, Hail, King of the Jews! They struck his head with a reed, spat upon him, and knelt down in homage to him. What kind of king is this? His purple cloak doesn't flow over the arms of his throne, but rather flows with blood from his wounds. His crown isn't crusted with jewels and gleaming with golden metal, but is gleaming with gore and crusted with torn skin. His subjects don't kneel in adoration or fear, but rather salute him with sarcasm and heap blows upon him rather than praise. What kind of king is this? The soldiers mocked him and beat him and spat upon him and then knelt down in homage to him a twisted parody of the true worship he deserves. What kind of king is this? He doesn't come in conquering power, but in submission to his father's will. He doesn't overcome death by killing, but by being killed. He doesn't overcome sin with burning fire, but with his own blood, freely shed for each of us. He is our king, and we are his people. Lord Jesus, you faced the torment of barbaric punishment and mocking tongue. Be with those who cry out in physical agony and emotional distress. You endured unbearable abuse. Be with those who face torture and mockery in our world today. To you, Jesus, the King, crowned with thorns, be honour and glory with the Father and the Holy Spirit, now and for ever. Amen. Holy God, holy and strong, holy and immortal, have mercy upon us. Thank you.